I hope you all have had such a lovely, wonderful week. Um, today is actually such a special, special day. It is the start of a month called Karthik in the Vedic calendar. This month is basically known as your spiritual recharge month. Uh, Karthik is such a beautiful time where people from the Vedic culture, they really focus on their spiritual practices. You know, by the time it gets to the end of the year, I don't know about you, but around this time, I'll start slacking. I start sleeping in a little bit longer and I just end up feeling a little bit exhausted. But Karthik at this time is the time to spiritually replenish. And so it doesn't have to be anything big. It can simply be adding in just one extra thing that really supports your spiritual journey. Whether it's waking up a little bit earlier, whether it is increasing the depth of your meditation or the length of your meditation, whether it's reading or listening to spiritual people that share their wisdom, whether it's reading spiritual books, really it's about trying to be conscious of the time that you have and how you're utilizing it. Whether those things that you're doing are really enhancing you spiritually or whether they're kind of pulling you away from it. Um, and so I really love this month so much. It's actually so magical. And I've had so many wonderful experiences. This is actually the month where I started my early morning wake up journey um, a good few years ago when I started waking up at 3.45 to get to the temple for the first prayers, the first meditations, which were starting at 4.30. I thought I'd do it for a week and I ended up doing it for over a year. And I have to say, just absorbing into a practice for that longer period or even a shorter time than that, these 30 days, starting something that you really want to continue on for the rest of your life as part of your routine. This is the time to do it and no matter whether you choose one thing or five things sit down write them down and make sure that they're attainable make sure that they're things that you are going to be able to do every single day because really it's about consistency because we can wake up and do 10,000 things in one day and feel great but that doesn't mean we're going to be able to maintain them for the rest of the year or even the rest of this month so I really have from experience realized that it's so much more about consistency consistency is the key to change being able to maintain something for a long period of time um, is actually such a incredible dedication that you're making to whatever practice that you choose. So make sure that whatever you choose is something that you feel you can maintain for this whole month and hopefully for the year ahead too. So um, yeah, I wanted to share that with you all because these months, this one month every single year has definitely accelerated and um, made me so much more enthusiastic about my spiritual practices. Um, this morning I was so excited, I ended up waking even waking up even earlier than what I set my alarm for. So please, if you would like to, I urge you to join me in these spiritual practices during the spiritual time uh, over this month and feel the magical moments with me um, and dig a little bit deeper into your heart, whether it is living more intentionally, whether it's in your prayers, whether it's interacting with people, really make it meaningful um, and make it memorable.